Hi folks, I'm Ryan from ORS Racks Direct here in lovely Vermont. Got this uh, Thule Frontier ES cargo box mounted up on the top of this car. I'm going to tell you a little bit about it, show you some of the features. The Frontier is part of the Time Travel series. They are older models that Thule just can't get rid of, can't discontinue because they've been so popular over the years. Uh, people would just freak out. So we still have this in the lineup, even though there are you know more sophisticated, more premium boxes available. What this has going for it, affordability, durability, um, and it's a great alternative to a traditional ski or snowboard rack. You know, if you're looking to carry your skis or boards, consider something like this. It will, you know, keeps your gear safe, uh, prevents it from getting all dirty from road grime. Um, you know, protects it from rain and sleet and snow and stuff like that. And you can also throw all your other gear in there as well. And you can carry a lot more pairs of skis. I mean, you could carry your entire quiver in there with all, and all your buddies quiver. And you know, you can just take what you need and, and jump out on the hill. Now, it is, as I mentioned, uh, designed to be affordable. So it doesn't have all the bells and whistles of some of the more premium boxes, which include dual-sided opening. This does not have dual-sided opening. It opens on just one side, which is the passenger side. Um, you know, it doesn't have the real smooth, glossy finish that some of the more premium boxes have. It's more of a dimpled finish, but it is durable. It's scratch resistant, and um, you know, it's, it's gonna it's gonna do the job. And the other thing it doesn't have is the quick mounting hardware. Thule has a really cool uh, hardware built into a lot of their boxes. Essentially, it's a claw that opens and closes on the crossbar with the turn of a knob. So this doesn't come with that. It does, however, come with what they call easy snap hardware. And this is it. You know, in the older days, you had basically these U brackets and you had these threaded knobs. So you had to kind of put one bracket on at a time, thread the knobs down. It was pretty time consuming. So this is a, an alternative to that. And this is how it works. So you've got this sort of uh, clamping device here and a U bracket. Now the U bracket itself, you can see, uh, is nice and wide. So it's going to fit any aftermarket bar, Thule, Yakima, Eno, uh, as well as virtually all factory uh, crossbars. So it's pretty universal. Now here we have it mounted on a pair of Thule crossbars. As long as your vehicle has uh, factory crossbars, then you wouldn't need to go with the system. You could just slap a box on top. Anyway, this is how it works. You got this U-bracket and you got this clamp. You pop this little lock open, you spin this open, and then the U-bracket is going to go underneath the crossbar. This is going to go inside the box. U-bracket is going to go into there. And then you just twist it. And as you twist it, it kind of tightens up on the bracket a little bit. You lock it down and you're good to go. Now there are a set of holes running on the bottom of the uh, cargo box. So you just find the set that you need, line up. This will pop down on top and you'll, as you saw, clamp, uh, clamp it closed. So the other uh, nice thing about this box, it does come with a lock and a set of keys. So when you, you know, close it down, you can lock it securely. The stuff is out of sight. It's very secure and, uh, as I said, protected from the elements. So once again, it's the Thule Frontier ES cargo box. By the way, it has 11 square uh, feet of cubic of space, which you know is quite a bit of space. You can put a ton of stuff in there, but most importantly, it's long, so it can carry any length skis that you might have. So Thule Frontier cargo box. Thanks for watching.